Poodles, shitting characteristics and maintenance requirements. Do poodles shit a lot? When it comes to choosing a dog breed, one of the factors that many prospective dog owners consider is the shitting potential of the breed. Some people prefer low shitting dog breeds, as shitting can lead to allergies, mess, and extra cleaning. Poodles are often recommended as a hypoallergenic and low shitting breed, but do poodles shit a lot? In this article, we will explore the shitting characteristics of poodles and provide you with valuable information to help you make an informed decision if you are considering adding a poodle to your family. Poodles, with their iconic curly and dense coats, are known for being low shitting dogs. They have a single layered coat that continuously grows, similar to human hair. Unlike many other breeds, poodles don't have an undercoat which is the primary source of shedding. Their hair instead grows long and keeps growing unless it is trimmed or clipped regularly. Regular grooming and maintenance of a poodle's coat is essential to prevent mats, tangles, and excessive shedding. Poodles require periodic trimming and clipping to maintain the desired length and prevent their hair from becoming unmanageable. Professional grooming every four to six weeks is recommended for most poodles. However, if you are willing to learn some basic grooming techniques and invest time in maintaining their coats, you can also groom your poodle at home. It is important to note that poodles come in different sizes, standard, miniature, and toy. While all sizes share similar coat characteristics, miniature and toy poodles tend to have more delicate and prone to tangling hair compared to standard poodles. This can lead to more shedding if their coats are not properly cared for and maintained. Therefore, it is crucial to pay attention to grooming and mat prevention in these smaller poodle varieties. Another important factor to consider when discussing shedding is whether the poodle is a mix or a crossbreed. Poodle mixes, often referred to as doodles, have become increasingly popular in recent years. While these designer breeds may inherit the low shedding trait of poodles, their shedding potential can vary depending on the other breed involved in the mix. For example, a Golden Doodle, Golden Retriever Poodle mix may shed more compared to a purebred poodle due to the influence of the Golden Retriever's shedding tendencies. In addition to regular grooming, a poodle's diet and overall health can also affect shedding. A balanced diet rich in essential nutrients is vital to maintain healthy skin and coat. Consultation with a veterinarian to determine the right diet for your poodle is crucial. Alongside a nutritious diet, regular exercise also plays a role in promoting overall well-being, which can positively impact a poodle's coat condition and shedding. While poodles are considered low-shedding dogs, it is essential to remember that no dog is truly hypoallergenic. Some individuals may still have allergic reactions to poodles, although it can be less severe compared to other breeds. Allergies are often triggered by dander, urine, or saliva, all of which can be found in poodles, despite their low shedding coats. Therefore, if you or someone in your family has allergies, spend time with poodles before making a decision to ensure there are no adverse reactions. In conclusion, poodles, with their curly and dense coats, shed less compared to many other dog breeds. However, they do require regular grooming and maintenance to keep their coats healthy and prevent excessive shedding. The size of the poodle and whether it is a mix or purebred can also influence shedding potential. Furthermore, a poodle's diet, exercise routine, and overall health play significant roles in its shedding characteristics. Lastly, it is crucial to spend time with poodles if you or your family members have allergies to ensure compatibility. By considering these factors, you can determine if a poodle is the right fit for your home and lifestyle.